It is only a temporary deal, but the European Union's decision to allow U.S. intelligence services access to the personal bank data of all EU citizens is a controversial issue. The move is supposed to help detect transactions between terrorist cells without violating privacy laws. It's a positive step that we have adopted, an agreement that improves protection of data within the European Union. We can also keep an anti-terrorist system that is efficient and proportionate. But it was no easy decision. Some member states like Germany and Austria had initially opposed the deal due to privacy concerns, only to come around this week. Officials were reluctant to provide more details and said the objections of individual states should not be the focus. Reports indicate the U.S. has exerted considerable diplomatic pressure on governments across Europe, warning them that refusing access to their bank data could impact the security of the West. The assessment of the EU counterterrorism chief, however, was much more toned down. Uh, I don't suggest that uh, Al-Qaeda is no longer a, a, a real threat. On the contrary, it's the main threat. And, and, but, of course, Al-Qaeda core has been uh, seriously hurt. <coughs> the U.S. started monitoring EU bank data in 2001, first secretly. It was only in 2006 that the EU public found out about the invasion of privacy. And many are still concerned. In general, I'm in favour of privacy. No, of course, it should be used only for very, very limited and well-defined purposes and objectives. I don't know what the United States government would do with my bank account information. EU officials said they will soon enter negotiations for a long-term agreement once the temporary one expires. The temporary agreement between the European Union and the United States will come into force on February 1st for the duration of nine months, only provisionally. This means the European Parliament, which has previously opposed such a pact, will have to consent to it. Otherwise, such an agreement will no longer be valid. Animal Press TV, Brussels.